So there's an update on that uh, disabled orca who used to go around, pretend to be a girl, to scam people to donate money to him. And she, oh God, you see, how this man, how this boy, they deceive us. And we don't, we don't know if you are he or is she. Well, he's a he, but pretend to be a she in order to get sympathy from the public. Because generally, generally, in the whole world, humans have more sympathy towards the female gender than the male gender. Yes, that is why people like Bob Risky decided to go and try the female gender. And the female gender is working for them. There is no woman that has come to the male gender. Eh? There's no woman that has decided to come to the male gender and uh, the male gender is working for her. We have not seen in this country. Oh. Let them come and use. You see how the life of man is extremely, really, really hard because they just believe we are meant to struggle and struggle and struggle and struggle. No, but we don't deserve it. But if a woman now, boom, help will just come. So the uh, disabled orca decided to become a woman and deceive gullible uh, audience out there. And she has been getting it. For Bray Jota alone, this boy collected one million naira. Bray Jota gave him 400,000, and then people around Bray Jota also donated 600,000. So, one million naira alone, and not only that one, this guy, they have donated a lot of materials uh, to him, make up materials, open a store, a studio for him, open an apartment for him, well equipped. Over the years of him being in school, that he has been living on a scholarship, free. But yet, it was never enough for this guy. This guy now does the turn social media influencer. He's not turning to social media influencer. Listen to what he said. He said, I dress as a woman so I could get help. I am a man. You dress as a woman so you could get help. What about the help you don't get since? You know about the enough for you. The help you have been getting since, is it that enough for you? Do, do you even know what you are doing or what you have done? Other people who really need help won't be able to get the help. Maybe somebody now was about to go and help someone, a woman. Or a, a, a young lady about to go and help that person, but because the cause of what you did, maybe just search it through the net and then the person come across your news, that person will no longer feel the need to go and assist that person again. Do you know what you have done? Do you know the amount of people you have taken food away from their mouth by your actions? This girl is gradually becoming a social media influencer. Now dancing on social media, posting. Before you know it, now Nigerians now go rally around the follower. Because the media, most of the people who get this massive fame, massive support in media, go and check them. Most of them are sharing morality all around. That is why, as parents, eh, you have the obligation, eh, to scrutinize what your child sees on the on 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 the internet. Educate that child, educate that child, because people with great amount of followers on social media are irresponsible people. Mostly, the people who actually preach responsibility get blasted every day, get downgraded every day. They don't have the amount of followers. They are not easily drawn to much crowd. Why? 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 See, okay, okay. Don't you guys think, like, have you guys really sat down to think, why, why is it that social media people always love hyping immorality? Why? 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 You see this girl uh, dancing, showing everything online. You see thousands of followers. Many likes, retweets, 
but sees a girl next where somewhere who got haze in Waek. The GP the GDP is so high. Just go and check the like and sorry, like and follow. Nothing. Nobody is, is talking about that. Nobody is attracted to it. Nobody feel like to hide that kind of person. Why? 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 Social media space, eh? Hmm? Eh? So why? We really need to be extremely careful. Someone that supposed, someone that is supposed to be called out, to be blasted will now gradually become a social media influencer. Being disabled doesn't mean you should be wicked now. Being disabled doesn't mean you should be wicked. Being disabled is a reminder that you have to be appreciative. You have to have that softness. Huh? Before you commit any crime, why not think about other persons? You still have the obligation to make the world a better place. Think about other people who might want to use the same avenue to, to, to achieve something great in life. But you will spread that particular thing for that person. That is why many people do not even like to give people, uh, give all those baba, babalawa and all those disabled people outside again. Do not want to give because some people, if you assist them, they will still come back to that street. Give them house. They will still come back to that street. They're looking forward to the next epa. If they assist you, you pick yourself up from there. You wish other people well. The reason why, even see, it's good that if, if anybody out there assists you with 500 naira, you are a beggar, I'll give you 500 naira. You can be human enough. Take 100 naira from that 500 naira and give it to the next beggar. You will never see a beggar giving money out. Beggars, eh? Beggars. Be it the street beggars. Be it beggars who are in the office. Be it your friend who is a beggar, always begging you for money. It's extremely hard for them to give anybody one couple. Beggars do not feel the need to give because they feel... They are the ones that are always needy. They are very, very needy. Very, very needy. You know, today is Friday, and uh, according to Muslim calendar, you know, it's like going to the central, uh, it's like the church to them. They're going to go more. So I can also use this whole video to preach, me being a Muslim. <laughs> we really need a lot of preaching. These people are spoiling things for people, they spoil things for other people. That street beggar is supposed to be arrested. There are some street beggars that are way more richer than you. You that cannot pay for rent, you give that your 200 naira to a street beggar. You discover that that street beggar, if you see, he has many. If you see the food, me, you go eat there, uh, you go eat like 2,005 food. Meanwhile, you know if you eat 500 naira food, but from your mind, from your cleanliness of your heart, you give that street beggar 50 naira or 100 naira. I, I'm not discouraging anybody not to give up. There are some people that knows about those things, but in their heart, they just be like, say, see, if I give you a money, now you know what you want to use and do, I give for my free heart. I don't care whether you are a beggar or a grateful beggar or not. There are some beggar now, this that doesn't even collect 10 naira again. Beggar, not they collect 10 naira, 20 naira, 15 naira. You should not give the 100 naira up or they'll say, I beg you. Man, we are in deep trouble, guys. Yeah? Please, to people like this guy, young as young as you are, you don't they do scam. You never do you. Okay, tell me how much you need for you to say you are okay. Will you continue to beg and beg and beg? You say you they dress like a woman just to get help. Who teach you? We, we know maybe your childhood must have been rough. God have assisted you now. The same God that have assisted you, the one exposing you now. Don't you know now they say enough is enough? Okay, you will run into trouble with this thing because God is just trying to tell you leave this thing, mind your makeup, use that small money to put business. Someone got one million naira, and David Doe was even about to assist him. <laughs> and David Doe discovered, say, he was about to be played. And David Doe run. 
you are not serious. You they spoil other people's work. You they spoil other people's work. Well, guys, to end this video, check out uh, Mr. Easy and his uh, wife, Timmy Otedola. No, Mr. Easy and Timmy Otedola marry. Eh? Nobody here about that. You see, eh? this life, eh? any Timmy, anybody, no here, eh? no this boy. Yes, so any Timmy, many people know here, no this boy. Any Timmy, many people know here, no this boy. Always like learn to keep your mouth shut. Me myself, I'm able learning to keep my mouth shut when it comes to first personal achievement. I'm in learning every day to keep my mouth shut. I'm learning every day not to expose myself all these things. I'm learning every day to keep my mouth shut. Continuously learning it. Someone said, "Love is blind." True, true. I mean, look at the lips a billionaire daughter is kissing. <sighs> no, they disrespect. Uh, Mr. Eze again. Mr. Eze is a fine guy, black beauty, sexy for that matter, has money. He has one of uh, the most hits coming from Africa. He's well to do. So they don't tell you, say, man, no hoggy. If mass have been knack, if man can satisfy a woman and can take care of a woman well, responsible, that's what a man needs. Women made they chop fine too. They go check where they did. Always get their heart broken and broken and broken onto the next one, broken onto the next one, broken onto the next one. Man, know they ugly. Man just need to be responsible and can treat you well. That's all. And a fellow guy, they will talk this guy too. You know? <laughs> well, guys, thank you very much for watching your boy Adam Slink. Wonderful to stay blessed. Bye.